Hi, YouTubers and what savers everywhere. It's MarvinGeorgeTune.com. I'm back in our video. Well, it's unboxing time. That's right. It just arrived today. Saw it on my doorstep. Just brought it in. Let's take a look and see what we have. All the way from alrasa.com. I will have the link for you below. And this was suggested by uh, someone on Badger and Blade, as a matter of fact. So we'll get rid of some packaging stuff. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. All right, first up is this guy right here. There it is right there, Shone. Shone, and I, I'll bet you can guess what this is. I was really curious about this, and I got this to show you that it could be a very, very nice Christmas gift for the wet shaver in your life. Look at that, there it is. It's a stainless steel shaving bowl. Let's unwrap this. There it is. Not bad. Very lightweight. It's stainless steel. has a very, very thin wall to it. And look how that fits. That fits very nicely. Really nice. Not bad at all. There's the bottom. Can you see that? Shown? Is that how it's pronounced? Shown? Anyhow, very nice. It is stainless steel, but again, it's, uh, it's thin walled, but and it has a little fastener holding the handle in place. But a lot of reviews said that the lid did not match the body of the bowl that well, that it had a hard time uh, sticking and being a little bit oversized and that sort of thing. But this one, look how that nicely that fits. Just, just the cushion of air just kind of closes it. That's really a nice fit. That's very, very nice quality. And again, it's very, very uh, thin wall. It's not really that thick. So we'll see how it holds up, but it is stainless steel. So I'm really looking forward to uh, trying this one out. And it looks like uh, it'll be good for, oh, I don't know, uh, a puck of uh, Mitchell's wool fat or uh, even Tabak or um, Pré de Provence, anything like that. Uh, I'm really looking forward to using it, but that looks really, really nice, and that would make a great Christmas gift. And I am very impressed by uh, the packaging that came in this box like this. So anybody receiving this, uh, I mean, that's anybody opening this up, receiving this would be uh, would be thrilled to get it. It's a really nice package, and the way they have it in there like that. So that's really nice. That's very, very nice. Okay. Number two. Now, this is something someone on Badger and Blade also mentioned to me. And again, um, you've probably seen my videos where I'm talking about the Petite Grande and the Petite Piccolo. Well, I believe, I'm going to do a little more research. I believe that this particular razor, and look again, look at the nice packaging they have on this. Again, this would make a great, great gift. Let's open it up this way. Da, 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 da. Look at that. Isn't that nice? There it is. This is a Shone Open Comb Razor. Very much like the Fatigue Grande, only has a different kind of handle. It's a three-piece razor. The handle is hollow like the Grande, and still a little cold from being outside. And, uh, Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Beautifully, beautifully plated. I believe this is nickel plating and it's solid brass. And the comb is just slightly different than that of the Grande. Let me get my Grande. Okay, here's my Grande and here is the brand new Shone. And you can see that they're very, very similar. I think the Shone here on my left has a fewer, a bit fewer teeth than the Grande, but you can see it's very, very similar. It seem to be similar in weight, but boy, the plating on this is very, very nice. Plating on this is nice, but look, isn't that nice? Isn't that beautiful? Could have gotten this in gold with the same handle style as the Grande, but I wanted to go for this. This is a really nice, really unique kind of a handle. Not quite a barber pole design, but it pretty much is. But anyhow, we're going to shave with it. We're going to do a couple of reviews for these. I want to show them to you. I'll have links below if you're interested in it. The packaging is really nice. It really is beautiful. It's a beautiful looking razor. It promises to give a really, really nice shave. 
uh, very much in line with uh, the, um, the Grande that I have right here. And um, boy, I'm looking forward to using it and, uh, and having a great shape. So I'm gonna have to compare the two of them because that's what I'm going to do. I believe that, they're, that they come out of the same factory by the same maker. Don't quote me on that, I have to do a little more research. But boy, really, they're both really, really very, very nice. But the Shone, this is the new star. Had to have one for my collection and uh, really looking forward to using it and seeing how this handle also performs the gripping and see what kind of shape it gives me. So, okay, that's it. I believe it's shown. I believe that's how it's pronounced. If it's not, please correct me. Comment below and let me know. All right, that's all I wanted to mention to you. Uh, thanks very much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. Um, uh, please subscribe, hit that bell so it'll give you a yell the next time I uh, upload a video. Check out my blog, georgetune.com slash blog for my comic strip George, other cartoons, other videos like this, and I'll see you again real soon.